so emotional right now. So yeah, I'm going through the hardest time of my life right now. So let's explain a few things in my past where things have gone a little bit dark and you know, when I first met Grace, it was awesome. You know, we had a major time, it was banging. I said, I said, Grace, what's so special about you? She said, basket, I got three tits. I thought, fucking, that's quite special. Then later down the line, I realized she only had two tits. She was lying, it was dark times. I was a little bit sad and that, you know, I felt lied to and all that. Deceitful. Betrayed. Betrayed. And once upon a time, I heard my uh, tumble dryer go in, it was going boom, 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 boom. I thought, what's happening in there? I thought someone had put a pair of shoes in the uh, tumble dryer. No, my uh, old housemate had put my cat in the tumble dryer. True story. Stupid. It was in there for 18 minutes. Thought he'd kill my cat. It's, it survived, but it was a sad time. But we overcome all these situations and dark times. You know, you find those strong people by your side who kind of support you, pat you on the back, push you forward. But it's taken a turn for the worse in my life. And uh, something's popped up. It's the saddest time ever. I don't know why you laugh all the time. Not you know I'm sad and you're laughing. So what can be sadder than all of that? Well, I'll show you this. My favorite skate park of all time is going. Uh, health and safety reasons, they are filling it in. They spent 9,000 pounds on concrete to make it in the first place. Uh, a little bit more on the landscaping and yeah, because of health and safety, they are filling the skate park in. Bloody shame. I've had some bloody good times at this skate park. <laughs> Absolute blinders. And uh, the local community got together and they said, no more, no more. They need to fill it in. I know, uh, enter at your own risk, it says. But I've got to sort of, uh, I've got to take it all in, Grace. I've had some bloody good times here. And as it sort of, uh, it leaves my grasp, bloody upsetting. I remember the day when I had to get rid of the basket yard, you know, I burnt it down in flames. I end up coming to this place and uh, yeah, touches my bloody heart, it does. You can see all the perfect transitions and stuff. That mini ramp, oh man, it's seen some good times, that mini ramp. The uh, the coping is some washer nine poles. Someone went out and nicked some washer nine poles. And uh, I first took Grace here when we uh, first met. And she did her first shotty on that little chair there. She went on a whitey, it was mental. They said it's too much money to transform this place back into a skate park like a proper one. You know, just blend it all in and stuff, but they're filling it in. And it's a sad, bloody day. And this is the main reason why I haven't put out a vlog in a few weeks. I've been so sort of emotional about the whole situation. I've just been at home, depressed, drinking. So the only way to overcome a sad situation like that, we should just go on a mad one. We're at a play parking out now. Come on, come down the pole. Go. Okay. went right underneath my ass. <laughs> oh. So yeah, I've uh, gone through the whole play park just to sort of bring back some sort of uh, fun times in my life. Because I'm a bit emotional about the skate park. Just crunched me nuts on the seesaw. 
and now I'm on the final piece. This uh, thing looks a little bit dangerous, like everything else around here. So, uh, give me a spin, honey. Got to be real fast. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Not even shitting you right now. I just spam around the gnat, and honestly, it was like doing 20 shotties in a row. So uh, I have dared Grace to do it. She was a bit scared, but she is going for it. And I'm going to spin around and watch how she walks after, like a baby giraffe. <laughs> In. And I've got to grab your legs. You're going way too fast. <gasps> oh uh, so, start walking. Oh Honestly, start walking. It's mental. It's like you're, you're born again. It's like walking outside of a nightclub, isn't it? Where are you going? It's like being sparked out by Mike Tyson. So, because Grace just did that, she's not span out like that since doing her first ever shotty. She doesn't like spinning out. Ever since going on a whitey, she uh, sketches out a little bit, but she did that. And then she come to me after and she said, Basket. She calls me Basket. She said, Basket, I need some help. I need your brain. I said, throw it at me. What can I do? How can I help you? She's got a video planned. She wants to apply makeup to her face while skating. I like this plan, I like this idea. She goes, I need to borrow Gary, and I need your brain, like I just said. And you need to cook up something to film her while supplying makeup, while skating. Yeah, this is kind of what it looks like, the finished product. We've got Gary on the end of a stick, Gorilla tape, load of zip ties, Grace's helmet, so she's gonna wear this while skating and apply makeup. Um, I think the angle might be all right. I've got to do a few tests first, but uh, yeah. She asked me to do a job, so I did a proper job. Proper Somerset Bridgewater job. We've got like, yeah, zip toys and stuff, and the elusive selfie stick that you can take into theme parks. Oh shit, no. You go into a theme park with a selfie stick these days, they think it's a fucking gun. It's a weapon, apparently. Oh, you can have that. I'll have you running around like Harry Potter and his wand. Fuck's sake, what's wrong with people? So I'm currently looking at my garden. Yeah, the uh, GoPro on the uh, helmet, I think I've nailed that. I'm currently looking at the garden. Me and Grace were motivated earlier. We decided to paint all the fences and stuff. You can see this from a different angle. It's playing now. We got some little uh, borders and stuff. We painted all that up. We cut the grass nice and short. We're getting rid of the grass. We don't want the bloody grass anymore. The uh, the less maintenance, the better. Uh, I want to gravel the whole lot. So when it comes winter, I can kind of clean my bike down and stuff on top of the gravel, rather than on the grass. And uh, yeah, it looks quite smart as it is right now. Definitely painting the fences looks a lot better, but there's a few items that I need to borrow from the uh, local woods. I need a wheelbarrow, I need a pickaxe, and I need a fork. So yeah, as you can see, the uh, basket engineering sorting uh, MVP right out because she uh, dedicated herself to the old spinning challenge. We are currently walking in Kingscliff, and uh, yeah, just giving this little uh, thing a test. You right, Grace? I can't quite turn my head. Oh, I can actually. Yo! So yeah, we have made it to the back of uh, Kingscliff Woods. As you can see, I don't know if you can see it. If I angle it down like that, but there we go, you can see it now. We have got the pickaxe, we have got the fork. It's got a bit of a, one bit of fork missing, and the barrow. We have now got to walk two miles back to the uh, car, get some jobs done, and then this is coming back into the woods. But let me just fit the GoPro forward again. We are going to see you again tomorrow morning. We are going to be at the skate park. Grace is going to be filming her video with this monstrosity and uh, 
I'm going to be riding BMX, so uh, we'll see you again in the morning. Holy shit, can you see my ears from there? Absolute beast, look at them. See them from space. Oh, Whee. very nice of her. <laughs> it's nice, isn't it? It's brilliant. Love you. Oh, lovely to see. Great. Classic, look at it. That is engineering at its finest, that is. And that is a finished product. Yeah, Don't get too bad. close. Don't get too close. Don't get too close in the foot one. I was literally hoping the lipstick was going to go right up your face. We should what you do that, that for the thumbnail. Yeah, mate, what do you think? Five, you said. Give me five. Give me a thumbs up. <laughs> so, yeah, makeup challenge complete. You have to see that on her channel. Uh, I want to sort of uh, swap this over onto my foreface and go down in with it. But until then, we're going to get some BMX clips at this skate park for a laugh. Yeah. And I'm going to put some sort of blusher on and stuff. And you want to put some on? <laughs> Bit of lippy? Nah, there's plenty here. The infamous egg. It's a golden one. Well, it's pink, but... <laughs> yeah, I'll be there in a minute. Oh my god, this thing's horrendous. Oh my fucking good god. It like blocks my vision. Can't see shit, man. Grinding. Yes. Round the swerve. Got my swerve on. I need to snap the ledge, didn't I? Uh, yeah, go on, just do one run with it. I'll do it. Honestly, he's a beast. Come on, son. Hand it over. Cosmo's gonna get some stuff. Like nah. It will choke you a little bit, but just, just handle it. Nah, mate. Oh, Sam, not like that. It's good, mate. Is, it, is this for the, for the YouTube? Obviously. Nah. That's <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> Yes! Mm. Oh! Fucking thought my head was gonna fall off! Yes, Cosmo. Me and Coz, insane in the membrane, mate. He's off to do a few shotties, so am I. So, uh, 
See you soon. Spray mate, spray mate. Like, boosh. Fucking, I broke his wrist, mate. Broke it. <laughs> Snapped it clean there. <laughs> So yeah, vlog done. Uh, I have no idea how this sort of went. We was one minute depressed about a skate park disappearing. Next minute we was uh, making some monstrosity to go and grace his head. You obviously see her video on her channel. I don't know how it came out. Hopefully it came out all right. I think so. I filmed some extra angles for her and uh, me and Coz. You gotta understand, Coz, he's 15 years old. He's actually half my age. And oh my uh, God, busting a few moves and stuff. All good times and uh, yeah. Hope you enjoyed this one. Thanks for watching and bye for now. Ta ta, motherfuckers. Get your cha ta ta's. We've got the fuel light on, so we've got to go get some fuel. Just thought I'd sort of chuck that in. Fuck your merch and all that. I ain't going to church. Fuck your merch. Eh? Oh, that'd be a perfect t shirt. No, Fuck your merch. I ain't going to church. Trademark it. Trademark! Yeah. Trademark! But then I can't sell it because I don't sell merch. I'll <laughs> sell it. I'll fucking sell yeah, it. Yeah, go on and that's your one then. Happy days.